Shannon and I am taping in the car. My car, I'm not driving. Do you ever watch YouTube videos where people are driving and you're like, oh, oh my gosh, distracted driver. Even though I'm not the most perfect driver, it kind of scares me to death. I'm parked. My, both my kids are asleep. I can't transport them in the house without waking them up. So here I am going to tape. So it's week whatever. It's week, it's whatever number week this is, is the week after going to grandma's, which is a really stressful time for me because I'm not in my own kitchen. Number one, there's not foods for me to eat there and I'm not in control of everything. And four hour drive there with babies and um, a lot of fast food. It's almost always been always fast food. A lot of fast food lately because uh, grandpa now pretty much only eats soup and grandma eats softened foods. So, you know, no, my mom's the only one cooking and uh, I don't know where anything is at kitchen. So, my plan was to take on the go muffins from the Trim Healthy Mama cookbook. I wasn't too impressed with them. Maybe I screwed it up. Um, I'll try it again and um, I'll see if I like them. I mean, they're only two point, two Weight Watcher points per muffin, which, you know, totally eaten two with some yogurt. I'm cool with that. But I wasn't impressed. They stuck mostly to my paper versus, you know, in my belly. Um, the baby likes them, but then I left half of them. So one day, uh, so Saturday, I went with my mom grocery shopping, grabbed some salad, you know, a big box of organic Walmart salad mix, because I could probably, you know, eat through that over a weekend, right? And I got some powerful oatmeal, because I had a feeling I didn't want those muffins one day, and I was very right. So, I get home, I want to have my salad with some chicken strips I bought, you know, the pre-made chicken slice strips. Cool. This salad, it says expire the 17th. I'm pretty sure it's not the 17th, even today. And it is bad. It is all bad. I got barely two bowls of salad out of it. Usually I can scrape at least a quarter of a bowl or more. Oh, I was so heated. I mean, considering that's like four or five dollars. And that's what I was going on. I mean, I brought some cauliflower and broccoli that was about to go bad anyways. But there's only so much broccoli you can have in a day. That's why I usually stick with broccoli in the evenings and then I have salads in the middle of the day. Or, you know, those random times. I usually don't do broccoli all day long, all day long. And also, I didn't want to cook it. At least salads I could throw on a plate, throw on some, there you go. Food. Dinner. Good. Yum. Mmm. <sighs> so. Oh, I never even mentioned, I just had to restart taping this. Because I was like, dude, I can't see myself talk. And I was like, put my finger on the camera. So. So, after all this, I did a lot of fast food. I did eat some healthy, good meals. I probably didn't eat a lot of fruits and veggies, who knows. There were, I was staying up way later, and you see, I go to bed around 10 or 11, but I'm hungry till like one, because I'm pumping, or the baby's nursing, and I don't wanna go sleep with the baby nursing on me. So I wanna wait till he's asleep, till I can get escape to go sleep, so I'm hungry. So I'm, their time difference is different. So I, and my mom goes up, so goes to sleep later, cause she has to take her grandma. So, you know, wound up being up to like one some days and I'm like, and I'm not even in bed. So therefore I'm like, eat, 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 eat. So after all this, you know, the day I drove down, we drove down, I only got 900 steps by the time we got home. Wow. On, on a day, even with all the nursing I do, I usually hit like 2,000. I'm not even trying, just living. So that's not even a lot of movement. So today, my weigh-in is Wednesday, so I will have a funky weigh-in day next Monday. Was 265. I haven't fully went to the bathroom because you know how you go to trips and you're all funky. Um, plus with the un... <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. I'm still coughing. Um, with an un-childproof house, 
I couldn't, you know, go to the bathroom, relax to go to the bathroom, just enough to, hey, I'm not going to die. So, um, 2.65. So that is what I've been saying is my pre-pregnancy weight with Shane, my toddler who's behind me. And you'll hear him whining because he does that when he's sleeping in the car seat after 20 minutes. Wow. Wow, how did this happen? I don't know. Miracles. So what I did was healthy breakfast. Healthy, healthy breakfast, mostly trying to keep it under eight points, plus my coffee, which tends to be three to four points, because I use half and half, and I found whipped cream down there too, so I still put my whipped cream in there. That is my treat for myself. Um, then lunch was either something I'd whip up around there, or if we went out for lunch, it was whatever hot fast food. So by the time we got in Lexington on Friday, I asked mom to get my get me a salad from McDonald's. Uh grilled. I didn't even ask her to get grilled, she just got it grilled. That's cool. Because Friday night, Arby's. So I got one big sandwich, a kid fry, and then I later ate some fruits and veggies and I got two grandmas. Saturday, healthy breakfast, Burger King kids meal that I split with the baby. I really wanted salad, but I don't think my mom heard me when I say sal said salad. Uh, well, I was going to eat a salad in the car that I got at Walmart, but I never got to it. So when I got home, it was that salad and some more veggies or something. I don't know. I don't remember. Maybe some chicken. Um, and on my munch on more chickpeas, the roasted chickpeas. I could put a link of the recipes I've used for those roasted chickpeas because if you do them right, like where they're really small, they're like crispy, like popcorn. Like if you like the slightly burnt popcorn that's hard or almost popped popcorn, they taste like it. Except you know, so much protein, so good for you, fiber, all this other stuff. And my toddler, who hates food, loves chickpeas. Not every day, but occasionally. So I had to make four cans of chickpeas yesterday and wound up only taking two cans of chickpeas because he ate pretty much a whole batch. So I probably ate way too many fruits on Fridays. You know how you know you should probably track them after so many, who knows, whatever. Um, but I didn't because I never really track fruits and vegetables. This is a uh, flat white, not a holiday flat white because it has sugar in it, but it's a regular flat white with non fat milk. So I think it's six points and I like it. Um, Sunday was the day I knew would be crazy because we was going to go visit my Aunt Diane, who only has one fast food restaurant in the place, and that is Dairy Queen. So, healthy breakfast. What I have for lunch? Maybe that's a salad day. I don't know. Oh, I roasted veggies when I got home, but I don't know why I had dinner. Oh, yeah, that salad, that bad salad, and then some chicken. So that morning I had that salad, plus I don't remember what else. And so we went to Diane's, and I knew it'd be Dairy Queen, so I'd already figured it out. I was going to get the mushroom Swiss burger. That's like 17 or 18 points if I remember. And then I was going to get Kid Fry. Um... I did put uh, some clementines in my bag, but they were in the back seat. And, uh, I just I really don't like opening oranges and clementines because of the smell. And I didn't have baby wipes. My kid vomited. The baby. The baby vomited because he's crying so badly because he doesn't like my brother. And my brother was in the back seat. So I ate my fries that we switched. Okay, I know it's bad. I switched my big, large fry with mm, my toddlers or was it the day before either way we've been switching the kid fries for the large fries so the toddler who pretty much only eats french fries got the large fries and i would get the kid fries or maybe that's the day i was like i've only ate like 15 points i'm gonna eat a large fry because i did eat one large fry over the weekend but i can't remember when and then i ate my burger which was wonderful i don't really eat a lot of red meat um I actually eat more red meat as an adult than I ever did growing up. Um, and, uh, the next day, we do, at one point we went to McDonald's and I got a chicken sandwich. Maybe that's the day I had the large fry. I don't remember. Um, man, I should have asked for no mayo because that was a lot of mayo on that one. So on our way 
back at McDonald's, which was the chicken sandwich. Oh, yeah, that's the Lord Friday, I think. And um, I got even the crispy chicken sandwich because I had only ate like 15 points that day. And I was going to die eventually. And uh, then I think I had the Lord Friday. Uh, then yesterday was a, a weird wonky day. My mom invited me to her old work friend's uh, Christmas thing, which I've been to occasionally. Um, I, last time I went was when I was pregnant with my first son. So, uh, we went, everyone screaming, was they hungry? Because we woke up at 11, the time we were supposed to get up out of the car, in the car. So, we, we, we honestly was wearing the clothes we wore the day before, except I think I changed one shirt and someone changed one pair of pants. Um, we get there and... I really don't know what to order, so I remember at one point I planned, but I did not make a egg shashuka. So I got the egg shashuka because it's pretty much uh, tomatoes and some veggies, and you could put cheese in there, but I didn't get cheese, and then four poached eggs. So I mean, if you are on freestyle, that's probably super good. There's probably oil in there, so I did my uh, my menu planning of the egg shashuka, which mine was going to be a white bean egg shashuka. Um, I put that in, that so that eight points, but I added some oil because it looked a little greasy on top. So that, that's four points. Now I got some turkey bacon, which I split with the toddler. So I forgot how many pieces of that, two or three. So I don't know. I, I don't know if it was done in oil or not. So I just kind of like put four. So it's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine-ish. Then I had a cappuccino there. So I'm assuming it's whole milk because I've decided the... A cappuccino, even with whole milk, is 6 for 18 at the local place I go to. I figured, hey, that's okay, because this is 6. So, uh, I did cappuccino because I fig I knew the po points for that, which would be 3. Because it was a little tiny. I'm like, I need more coffee than that in my life. I, d I walked out of the house with no coffee and never got even coffee because we were running so late. Um, then I wound up getting another flat white later in the day because we went to Aldi's. Um... Did I, did we, did I eat some cheese or something yesterday? I don't know. I don't think I tracked yesterday right. I can't remember. Um, then I came home and made white bean chili. If you do Weight Watchers and you have the Weight Watchers app and program, there is a recipe, white bean turkey chili. It's a very soupy chili. Um, my husband has to drain off half the uh, chicken broth, but it's super good, and I'm really picky about beans, and it's zero points now. Unfortunately for people who are not on freestyle like me, now I have to figure out the points itself, but I, I made it before, so I'm pretty sure it was five for one cup, because I had it, it had it in my app as ten points, because I knew I got a double serving, so I ate like three servings, just, four servings yesterday. So... I am amazed. Have you ever lost weight and just been on weeks you never imagined you could, like Thanksgiving and traveling? I am utterly, utterly floored. Now, I may not, you know, lose weight much on Monday uh, because where it's Wednesday and where it's, um, where I'm starting to exercise again, but. It is what it is, um, but hey, you know, maybe I'll eventually get to go to the bathroom without kids. There is a cop just circling around this neighborhood. Do I look suspicious? This is my own house. My kids are sleeping. I've always wondered about that. Do I look suspicious in front of my own house? But, uh, is there any difficulties happening this week? I can't think of any. Um, my next major hump in the month of December, I believe, is Christmas Day. Um, it's going to be a brunch style. There's going to be my favorites. Biscuits, eggs. I don't know what I'm going to do with myself. Because it... I mean, other than just make manageable portions and bring some salad to eat with it. Get some veggies and some good fruits in there. I haven't decided. So. I, I, I passed one hump. Not huh? I'm going to not worry about it. We're just trying to relax the next few days. And then I'm going to worry about that hump. I'll figure out and do some some cal point, uh, point calculating and figure it out. How would your week go? Have you conquered the first or second, whatever weekend of December it is? Have you, have you uh, 
conquered any parties lately. I'll see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye!